there may be variation in the reproductive cycle length between mares, there is, however, a basic cycle pattern that most mares follow. The mare begins its puberty at 10 to 24 months, with an average onset of about 18 months. If interval between birth and next breeding season is short, uh, puberty can be delayed for 12 months. Although equine, like many other domestic animals, express each of the four primary phases of the estrus cycle during the breeding season, only two phases are routinely recognized, the estrus and diestrus. This species is unique in the proestrus occurs during estrus and metestrus during diestrus. The average length of estrus cycle is about 21 to 22 days. In some reported cases, cycle length may also vary from 7 to 124 days. The abnormally long cycles undoubtedly include a number of skip period or cycles. The average length of estrus in the mare is approximately 6 or 7 days. Ovulation usually occurs 24 to 48 hours before the end of estrus. The mare is receptive to the stallion and showing signs of elevation of the tail, standing with hind legs apart, squatting, urinating, and rhythmically erecting clitoris. During this period, also the ovarian follicles grow and develop between 30 to 50 millimeters in diameter. During diestrus, the period between successive estrus, typically 14 to 18 days, the mare is unreceptively to the stallion. The mare is usually in that LH is still rising when ovulation occurs and elevated progesterone level cause her to reject the stallion. If the mare becomes pregnant, there will be a progesterone block and CL will be maintained until approximately 180 days of pregnancy. After 180 days of pregnancy, the placenta will be the source of progesterone. Mares are seasonally polyestrous, with estrocycle onset influenced by photoperiod early in breeding season through March and April. Estrus tends to be irregular and long, frequently with no ovulation. This is known to be a transitional period. Late breeding season, typically from October to November, is another transitional period. Mares show intense sexual desire but do not ovulate and they probably will not conceive. Other mares may have only silent heat period in which ovulation occurs but no sexual desire is evident. From May to September, the period becomes shorter and more regular. The, with ovulation as a normal part of the cycle, mares with regular short heat period throughout the year can be successfully breed at any time of the year. Foul heat may occur one to two weeks after the fouling. Ovulation may occur during this period of estrus, and conception is possible in mare are bred during the foul heat.